Once Ro was drinking water in the stream. After quenching his thirst, he refreshed himself, raised his head and gazed at the beauty of the mountain pass. Pure water was thrown without fear from the high rock. When it fell down, it foamed, sterically forming a crown of rainbow colors. The roar could be heard far away. Seeing the deer that was amazed by this beauty, Stream gurgled so proudly that the valley echoed further and said have you ever seen such a tree in another place? This pride, it seems, did not please the road here, don't brag, don't brag. You should be more simple, he returned calmly. Why didn't I just go away, offended? You are really beautiful and I don't blame you for that. Your beauty makes me happy, makes me happy and makes me happy. When I look at you, I know I feel lighter and braver, but... No matter what. On the other side of this mountain there is a stream, which is not only clear, beautiful and brave like you, but also useful. He does not lose his power just to be decorated with rainbows. When it fades downwards, it turns a powerful iron wheel and thus produces light and illuminates the houses, it travels throughout the village. I tell him the valley. Until people have done you as a friend, it seems you can't do such a job. And do you know why some months of the year it brings a little water and some months plenty? Beauty alone is not enough, dear friend, and now farewell, brother. The row ran away faster into the forest. The valley warmed the waves with whispers. The words of the row enter his thoughts.